guys, welcome to my channel on today's episode of 100 Days of Cataween. I am bringing you an unboxing and also some footage of an event I had on Saturday at my house. It was just a little um, get together with some of my friends. Um, you know, we exchanged some gifts, we just cropped together, you know, crafted together, and it was a super fun event. Just relax, some good time with some good friends, some good food, watching some good movies. And um, like I said, we exchanged gifts. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys and unbox those with you the goodies that we swapped and then also the cauldron because what we had to do is um, goodies was not required but of course everyone brought a goodie for each other so there was a total of seven of us and then the requirement was for you to bring a loaded cauldron and that was gonna be like our swap, like our white elephant. And we had a little game where we all stood in a circle and I read a story which was either move left or move right and wherever you landed, that's the one you got to take home as long as it wasn't yours. So it was super fun. I really enjoyed my time with all my special friends and I'm gonna list their information down below in the description so you can go ahead and follow them. So let's go ahead and get started. At the end, I will have a little um, video clip of the party and then also some um, pictures that you guys can take a look at so let's go ahead and get started this first one is from Eva and she's sweet crafty gal on Instagram information will be on the screen and down below so she gifted this is really cute um, lunch bag or see it's sweet crafty gal so she put her sticker on here so this is Eva and it was really cute. I love how she decorated it with this tag and it also has her information on there. It's a little dye, you can tell because it's kind of like perforated. And then she put this really cute Tim Holtz rosette and an eyeball. And I think these are from the Dollar Tree and I love these eyeballs because they're colored, these googly eyes. And she put some awesome um, ribbon here. Definitely will be able to reuse this. We'll see what goodies are in here. So she gifted us some embellishments. How cute! So, some more of those rosettes. This really pretty paper flower is a bow. Really cute. Here's some crepe paper rosettes. I love this little ghost, she's so cute. Super cute. And then she gifted us some, a hot cocoa set. How cute! So it has the straw, the hot cocoa, and she decorated the little um, container, which is super cute. I love this little ghoul, so cute. And then it's a little um, sticky notepad set with a little gel pen. Really cute and then a little um, list pad that she decorated. Little witches, scary ghosts, smiling pumpkins on the post, flying bats up in the sky, trick-or-treaters marching by. So cute. Ooh, and then an assortment of die cuts. Look at this, there's stickers and all sorts of awesome die cuts in there. Really fun. Let me just show you a couple of them in here because we do have quite a few to go through. This trick or treat is awesome. If that's a die, that's super awesome, Eva. Little envelope, some little um, trick or treaters, and then this awesome, these awesome tags. Happy Halloween! Super neat. Thank you for sharing those. Something I can use in my crafting or for next year. A little um, pencil and pen set or like a highlighter really cute then this is another little list pad with some stickers and some um, little pencils in there thank you so much Eva those were so many goodies you went above and beyond I'm sure all the girls really loved everything that you gifted them so I'll put these back in here so again that was Eva for, uh, who is sweet crafty gal and then we have this one, which is from my friend, um, I think it's Papel y Tijeras, which is Jenny or Gravity PL, you might know her as that. And she, look how cute this little bag is. I think these are from Target. And then she put this awesome tag and this rosette and she colored this little witch, it's so cute. 
and she gifted us this little metal lantern. How fun is this? And she stuffed it with chocolates in there. Thank you so much, Yenny. I will definitely be eating those and using this to decorate my little desk. Next is um, Four Eyes Crafter, which is Michelle. Um, her little jars are so cute. This is the second time she's gifted us some jars and they're so cute. They came with a lid and then like a hat, which were decorated super cute, but um, she forgot mine and um, that's totally fine. I told her, don't worry about it. She was gonna give it to me at a later time. So I'm just gonna show you just an idea of what it looked like. This is of course a hat that I made earlier in my series, but it basically looked like something like this. Super cute. And she stuffed it with some um, confetti, so sequins in there, some little um, uh, spider webs, a nail polish, kindness, magic, generosity, honesty, loyalty. How cute. Oh, I love these. A little um, bottle brush uh, tree in black. Some um, candy in there. And then a fun little um, bow necklace. Thanks, Michelle. That's super fun. I love this idea of the little embellishment jars. Super cute. She was the first one I saw a while back do these. I've seen a couple other people make them as well. And then next we have um, Susan, who is Braddy Sue on Instagram. She gifted us these really cute cauldrons and she filled them with some goodies. So she made some embellishments for us really cute super cute little embellishments they're teeny tiny a little um rosette wand really cute i love these these are the ones from target and then she gifted us some awesome um gummies and these are from i don't want to rip this might have to yeah my well, i don't want to so these are from Sugar Fina, which are awesome. They're like, um, uh, what are they, what is the word that I'm looking for? Not luxurious, but like, you know, uh, oh, I can't remember. But they're, you know, more than your store-bought gummies. And then there's also a little sequence pot. Isn't this cute? this little gem and I just noticed something in here oh there's a little paper flower in here and I think I saw something else oops oh yeah so this is like a Tim Holtz ideology little 31 thank you so much Susan I will definitely be using this super cute well we'll just leave all the pretties on the table and then we have um, the one from my friend Lulu, um, or it's Luann. Can't remember. I think it's. I can't remember what her Instagram handle is, but it will be on the screen and down below. So this is from Luann. Super cute. It's got a little spider in there. Then these awesome foam flowers that she decorated. She put them on little toothpicks and she added glitter. Some paper bows look at that tiny little ghost so cute some more little embellishments Ooh, look she added glitter on the bottom that's so cute she went with pastel Halloween. she made some rosettes using the Tim Holtz rosette dye look at this eye how cute are these look at these Oh, she really took the pastelloween and ran with it. It's so cute. Here it says tags. Oh, cute. So she gifted us some little tags that we can alter. This glitter one is cute. And then, oh, so cute. There's a little, um, it's backwards but it's a little keychain that she made. And a 
little sequence pot that she decorated. And then I think the rest in here is candy. Thanks, Luann. So many goodies in here that I can definitely use for other projects and candy that I can eat. So many cute goodies. And then we have this massive thing from my friend Letty, who is 100 Pineapples on Instagram. And she just all gifted us all these really big, um, like skull bowls. Oops. And then she jammed, stuffed it with a bunch of goodies. So let's see, where do we start? So she made these ones, which are super cute. It's a little half rosette that um, she says that it can just come off and it can sit on your table. Super cute. Look at this amazing rosette. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at the eye in there and the spider web. Super cute. And here's another one. Look at her flowers. Her eye, attention to detail is just amazing. She's got such an eye for it. A little glass jar. A pumpkin pick. This little pot of um, flat back pearls. And then some slippers and this little dish towel rack. And look at this flower that she put a skull in the middle. Super fun. And then you get, you know, the bowl that you can use. Thanks, Letty. I know all the girls were blown away. You, you always just go above and beyond with your goodies for everyone. Just so much love that you put into it. It's amazing. On top of how much you work here, you blow me away, girl. And then for the, um, oh, and she also gifted us these, one for each. So a little um, beautiful butterflies and these awesome um, resin flowers that have like gold in there. And then I won the cauldron from her, which is just amazing. I mean, can you see that? It's just beautiful. So it's the skull bowl again, but in red. She put spiders all over it. And it's just jam packed with so much goodies. I have another pair of the dish towel rack and um, slippers, which I think I'm gonna give to my mom. And then in here, there is some foam um, foam dots, some like box cutters in these really cute colors. Some more of the butterflies and these beautiful white colors, which I think would be awesome for Christmas. Some foam roses, again, awesome for Christmas. This ginormous rosette, isn't this gorgeous? Look at all the spiders and bugs, it's just beautiful. Here's another rosette. She double layered the rosettes there. Here too. There's another one. Some beautiful little gems. Another one of those half rosettes. How cute is this? The use of the, her layering is beautiful. Here's another pot of uh, little flat back pearls. And then some um, wood veneer stars that are perfect for Christmas. And the rest in here is just filling, but it's just beautiful. Everybody did such a good job. We had so much fun. Um, my gift to them was a little mini um, cauldron that they decorated as a make and take. You'll see in the video, it was super cute. And overall, thank you so much girls for coming. I wish I could invite all of you guys to come over to my house. I hope you're having a very spooky time and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye.